I do think there's a sense of a core humanity that this program speaks to. What kind of day are you going to have today? Deep down inside, they want something positive to attach themselves to. It just makes for a better human being. Bunker Hill is an amazing school. Everyone is respected, safe, and I just love everything we do here. Kate. Bunker Hill is located in the village of Brooklyn in Northeast DC. It's a very diverse community, but it is a community that cares. One thing that we do ensure at Bunker Hill is that everyone pretty much has a seat at the table because we want to ensure that our scholars always have voice and choice. The diversity of the community also brings a sense of belonging and understanding that you are working towards a common mission and also that you have purpose. Good morning, Free To Be Me. Good morning. That's beautiful. The Free To Be Me Club is actually a group of third, fourth, and fifth grade students that have taken on some leadership responsibilities. To be quite frank, it started out as the Mean Girls Club because they were me. And I said, well, you know, you all are gonna come have lunch with me and we're gonna talk about this and how to respect each other's differences and get along in spite of those differences. We believe in inclusion. Who can tell me what inclusion is? To include someone no matter what. Much to my surprise, these students were willing to sacrifice their lunch time and their recess every week to come in and talk to me. And we talked about the various things that they would like to do in the community as far as homeless shelters, sending cards to sick children, and it just flourished from that point forward. And so today, I just want us to continue to practice random acts of kindness because you never know how much even the smallest act of kindness can turn someone's day around. Good morning. As a special educator, I try to make my classroom an environment where they want to come. That's why I call my scholars superheroes because I want them to feel like they are super students. High five. Way to work it out. Well, let's try it again. I met Lisa probably about 12 years ago. Lisa was just a go-to person. I was like, Lisa, I have a program for you. You're going to love it. It's called Unified Champion Schools. She's like, Anthony, say less. We're going to do it. I'm like, I'm going to you this program because we're going to do it. That was the five minute conversation. She's like, send me the paperwork. I'll sign it. We'll start this this year. And that is actually how the Special Olympics Unified Champion Schools came to Bunker Hill. So the Unified program gives students living with intellectual disabilities, those are our athletes, and then the students that are not living with an intellectual disability, the partners, they have an opportunity to learn skills, how to play together, how to share, how to win, how to lose. People understood what it means to be unified and then starting to teach them that at a young age. I was introduced to Bunker Hill by Lisa a few years ago. I've just been a supporter and a colleague. The fact that everybody wants to be respected Everybody wants to be included, regardless of what your station is in life, regardless of your demographic background or anything. Valuing every contribution, that's really what the core of this program is about. I absolutely love Bunker Hill. Inclusiveness is important because everybody, especially as a child, should always feel like they belong. Ashton, he's a fifth grader, unified. He gets the confidence. I think he gets the love, the support, the team feeling. For Bunker Hill, it's just good to know that we're sending Lily someplace every day, but she's with people who care about her, and that's important for me. Making sure that they're included, making sure that we know that they're welcome to be part of this Bunker Hill family. Young athletes, free to be me. Excellent job. Let's go. One of the students came back to the school and he won a gold medal. The mother came in the room and the child said, Mommy, look what I got. And he put his gold medal. He put his, he put his gold medal around his mother's neck. She cried. I cried. I'll never forget that. This gives them hope. It gives them an arena to excel in 
they find out how really good they are. And that peer-to-peer -peer connections that we want to make sure our kids are able to be social creatures, our kids are able to navigate the world, understand that as human beings there is a commonality, that is Unified Champion Schools. It's more important to be kind than it is to be beautiful, than it is to be intelligent, than it is to be rich. Because a single calamity can wipe all of those things out, but nothing can change the contents of your heart.